What's going on YouTube? This is Unger to the Max here. Salute. And this is just a regular video, not a live stream. Although, I am able to live stream again. But, the reason I am making this video is because I have major breaking news. The Kawhi Leonard trade saga is over. He is going from the Western Conference to the Eastern Conference. Because, I just got a notification from ESPN saying the Toronto Raptors, again, the Toronto Raptors, agreed to acquire Kawhi Leonard from the San Antonio Spurs in larger trade package that includes DeMar DeRozan. So, when everybody's going west, Kawhi Leonard is going east. But DeMar DeRozan is going west to uh, San Antonio. I'm baffled as to about I'm absolutely baffled about this trade. I'm stunned, really. Cause I thought Leonard was gonna end up in LA with LeBron. Although I think he's gonna be a free agent at the end of the season. So he might play with the Raptors for this season and then just end up in LA then at the end of the seat. For the next season. And be a Laker with LeBron. I don't know. But you think about this. I can't. Toronto just gave away. Probably it's best player. To San Antonio. Yes they got a. Premier all star. And one of the best. Def defensive players in the NBA. Back. But I can't say. It puts them ahead of Bob. I can't say it puts them ahead of Boston for the best team in the Eastern Conference. I still think the Boston Celtics are the team to beat in the Eastern Conference now. I'm not ready to put Philadelphia up in that category yet. Yes, that even though they made it to the second round of the playoffs last year, how many games did the series go with the Boston Celtics? Five. And yes, the games were competitive. I agree. But I just don't think Philadelphia has enough yet. Because they have... And you might be thinking, what the heck? What are you talking about? The 76ers have Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid. Yes. But what if they... What if for some reason, they both have off nights? Who's going to be there to pick up the scoring load? For Philadelphia. Nobody. That's why I think they need. Either a third superstar. Or. Just a third major scorer. And then I think. Philadelphia could be a legitimate threat. In the Eastern Conference. But. As of right now. I'm not ready to put them there, up there yet. Boston. They are. A legitimate team. Honestly, I want to see Celtics Warriors in the NBA Finals with everybody healthy. So that means Kyrie, Ir Kyrie Irving staying healthy, Gordon Hayward staying healthy, Al Horford staying healthy, uh, Stephen Curry being healthy, Clay Thompson being healthy, the Wussy, Kevin Durant being healthy. Yes, I will call him a Wussy. Drama Queen, Draymond Green being healthy. Sorry, sorry Warriors fans, but I'm calling him a Drama Queen. But I want to see everybody healthy. And I want that to be the NBA Finals matchup. Because if you saw the two battles that Boston and Golden State had this season, you want that to be the Finals matchup. I mean, for for Pete's sake, when when the Warriors and Celtics played each other in Boston, the Warriors were up by like 18 at one point. What happens? The Boston Celtics come storming back to win that game. And the game Saturday night in Oakland was a 
extremely competitive game. Ugh. It, I want that to be the finals matchup. I would make sure to watch every game of that series. Because just like I have for every Cavaliers at Warriors NBA Finals game. Which, by the way, even though LeBron has gone is now with the Los Angeles Lakers, I am a diehard Cleveland Cavaliers fan. So I will continue to watch Cavaliers games. I will continue to do live streams of Cavaliers games. I will continue to do Cavalier game uh Caval Cleveland Cavaliers game previews and post game videos and I will continue to go to games and make videos of in game footage for the channel. Even if I were to move eventually move to like Atlanta, Georgia, I'm a Cleveland Cavaliers fan till the day I die. Just that simple. So again, this was just a little NBA thoughts and analysis video just to get back into the swing of things. And again, the big trade news. The ter About 15 minutes ago, the Toronto Raptors agreed to acquire Kawhi Leonard from the San Antonio Spurs in larger trade package that does include DeMar DeRozan. So that's going to do it for this video. Like I said in the previous video, be on the lookout for an NFL live stream preview that I'll be doing. I'll be go doing season schedule predictions for the Jacksonville Jaguars, Cleveland Browns, and a few other teams, such as the Chicago Bears and the LA Chargers. And maybe a couple other teams. We'll see. But for now, this is Unger to the Max signing off. Salute, go Cavs, go, uh, go Jags, and go Jackets.